Okay, Mad Peace, so today I have a really fun wig I want you to try. I've always thought that you looked kind of like Britney Spears, so I got a blonde wig for you. I think it's just going to be really fun. I think that you'll look great in blonde, and it's just going to be interesting. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started. First, I'm just going to take a look at your hair as it is now, just to see what I'm working with. So you have quite thick hair. Um, I'm going to brush through it just to make sure there's no knots on beneath. We want the pin curls to lay as flat as possible okay. against your scalp. So just relax. Um, what, what occasion would you be wearing this for? I'm going to a party tomorrow. Oh yeah? And I'm wearing kind of black. Yeah. So I think the blonde would look really good with the black dress that I have. I think that will look so chic and really cool. I love all black looks. So it'll be a really good contrast with the light hair color. So that's exciting. Okay. Alright, and so this is a pretty simple process. I'm going to um, twist your hair up into little pin curls, pin them to your head, then we'll put the wig cap on. But before that, I'm going to spray your head with some water, just because it's really going to help flatten that hair, okay? okay. And it's going to make the whole process better, so close your eyes. This is just water, but I don't want to get any on your face. Have you ever tried a different hair color before? I did. Actually, a long, long time ago, I was, uh, I did go blonde. <gasps> oh my gosh. And... Like uh, dyed it or? Yes. Oh my gosh. Did you like it? I loved it. Wow. But not for a very long time. Then this uh, is perfect. Then I turned around and I was like, I just want to go back to my natural. Yeah. It's definitely a commitment. Yeah, so... But it's really nice to try wigs, and this way it's still very natural, and, and you don't, I don't have, have to, to commit to it. Yeah. yeah. So that's great. Right, close your eyes. Keep your eyes closed. Just a simple procedure of twisting.
Your hair is so thick. Does it usually take a long time to dry? I've never noticed that. Just uh, I don't know, five, ten minutes, I'd say. Wow, okay. But it definitely depends on how I style it and, right. you know. That's very true. You know, I've always wondered how they make the hair to look so natural and how it sticks to the yeah to the hat. And it's crazy. Yeah, there's um first we're gonna put you in a wig cap and then there is kind of like um a part of the strap that's actually on the wig mm -hmm. that's adjustable. It kinda of looks like a bra strap actually and it secures on. There's also something called wig tape that some people use and um, and some people Would you recommend the tape I don't have glue right now but this is just a practice and if you like it you can order some for your party well this is looking Pretty secure. The key is to really get this area above the ear because mm -hmm. that's where it tends to show if you're not too careful. Things are looking pretty flat, pretty good. We're definitely getting there. I'm just going to pin this back. Okay.
seeing a little bit of clumps in the back here. I'm going to turn you to your side here. Okay. We got your back a little wet, but it's pretty hot in here, so hopefully it doesn't feel too bad. No. Okay, good. like three or four strands left. Bend your head down if you would. There you go. Whoops. Don't worry about that. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and uh, secure this by the ear here. Okay. <laughs> your bobby pin fell on your skin. <laughs> Does that feel pretty secure? Yeah. Okay. And the more experience I get with this, the fewer bobby pins it will require. Today we used a lot, but I'm pretty sure... Wait, one more. And become addicted. Mm. Yeah, it just needs to be away from the ears. Perfect. Okay. So go ahead and bend your head down to your chest, into your chest. Let's see mm -hmm. if this works. Okay, head up. Okay. 
I think we did it the opposite way, but it should be. Oh, okay. No problem. Yeah, I think this uh, this part should be. All right, so again, <laughs> if you could do chin to your chest. Here we go. Yes, if you could hold that, that'd be great. Teamwork, okay. Beautiful, go ahead and let it go. All right, so it's a huge difference here because it's going to really help retain the hair a lot better. I'm going to push back some strays. And since it's a long wig, I'm not so worried about the back hair coming out here. Mm -hmm. I'm really much more wor not worried, but I want to be a stickler about the hair in front of the head and behind the ears. So. Getting there for sure. Um, this wig has some bangs, so go ahead and look at me. Okay, I think that's the best we're gonna get, which is pretty good if I do say so myself. Okay, so next. So I'm gonna push you ahead a little bit. Okay. So go ahead and touch your chin to your chest again. Okay. And if you could hold the top of this wig, mm -hmm. just hold it right at your hairline. Okay. I'm going to bring it down. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we secure it by tightening these two straps. Okay. Let's All see right. how, how that looks. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you look amazing as a blonde. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. I'm going to bring it a little bit forward. Wow. Um, let me see. We're going to sweep the bangs to the side. Wow, wow, wow. I love the color on you. It looks so good. Mm -hmm. You look amazing. Um, I'm gonna brush through it. Okay. I love how long it is too. I don't think I've had such long hair ever. Yeah, it feels pretty secure. I it does. And tight. Yeah. Okay. Good. Um, yeah, there's like a pin curl here that's just a little lumpy, so next time I would want to smooth that out mm -hmm. or just find a way to use less of that tactic.
but the color is perfect on you. You look fabulous. Want to make sure that it's smooth. Wow, it really does look like Brittany. Mm -hmm. It is gorgeous. Okay, and yes, I think next time I'd use less bobby pins. I'm going to see if I can take one of these strands and do a, a tiny braid. I think that will look kind of good. Okay. I'm going to put a little braid in the front, see what happens here. I think it might look cute, it might not. <laughs> we'll see. And definitely with this hair, I'm going to touch up your lips because I think it would look really good to have darker lips since your skin is lighter and the hair is lighter, you know, or just to give it a little pop of color. I yeah. think that might be a wise choice on our end. This hair is so long. It never ends. Okay, so. Okay. Sorry, I got a little crease here of makeup. Okay, perfect. So, go ahead and look at me. See? So beautiful. Oh my gosh. You look amazing with this hair. And next time, it's going to be less bobby pins, so you're not going to have... I mean, it looks great from far away, but mm -hmm. when I'm feeling you, okay. I feel these lumps. So... I'm going to hmm. Is this your D shining brush? Yeah. Okay. 
just going to de-shine you. Let's go ahead and close your eyes. Okay. Okay. Touch up your eyebrows, so I think they'll look more defined. Then look straight halfway, halfway down for me. I'm just gonna get your mascara. Just gonna touch it up a little bit. It already looks pretty good, but your wig looks so amazing. I want to make the rest of you look amazing. Okay. to get right underneath your brows with some light color. Beautiful. And just a little bit of, I think I want to do just some pink in your crease. I'm just getting the outer edges here. Yeah, I think that looks great. Starting. I just see a tiny little clump. I'm just being a perfectionist here. I'm just gonna separate some of that just to give you a more natural look. And so I'm gonna do the same thing here. I'm just gonna get rid of a couple clumps that I see and stay right where you are. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. And lastly, we're gonna do your lips. Yeah. I love this fun pink color. Go ahead and smush. Okay, I'm going to get your Cupid's bow. Just And smush. Okay, so 
So I'm just going to, I'm just seeing a little frizz pop up, so I'm going to use some wax. And get some of the flyaways. Like this section here is just. There we go. We're just covering a section of the wig that has a little frizz and roughness. Perfect. a little better. The braid is giving me like a hippie vibe too, which I don't know if you like or not, but for what it's worth. Um, yeah. Let me see. I'm going to remove one of these bobby pins just so I can smooth out this area here. And I'm pushing it down here. Oh, that's so much better. Yes. It makes me happy. And removing here. That's perfect. All right, just brushing it through. Mm -hmm. All right. So you look so good. Let's see. So here's a mirror. Go ahead and take a look. I love it. Yeah. I really do. Yeah. I was meant to be a blondie. You were, you <laughs> were. I think you look beautiful in both colors, but it's good to have options. Yeah. And it's definitely. good to know you can have fun playing. You play. did a great job. Thank you very much. Yay. Okay. Yay.